Well, Melbourne's inner city parklands are home to many different species of wildlife. Goats are not typically one of them. But a tribe of goats has landed in Royal Park today, set with the task of eating weeds to create a better habitat for the white's skink. Isabella Tolhurst has the story. Nature's own lawnmower hard at work, munching their way through weeds in Royal Park. You might call them lawnmowers, we call it conservation grazing. This tribe of goats have been part of a trial by the City of Melbourne to regenerate habitat for these little lizards. The whites skink have called Royal Park home for more than 20 years and it's rare to find them so close to the city. We are not kidding around when it comes to saving the habitat of the little lizards of our city. But weeds have become overgrown, so the goats have been brought in to conduct some ah! renovations. Goats are known for their appetite and are able to get into places that are otherwise hard to access. And they've been hungry to prove themselves. Already they're doing what they're supposed to be doing. They're eating the weeds um, and they're also really cute, which is a bonus. The great thing about goats is that they can weed without the need for pesticides, which can be harmful to environments like this. If the trial is successful, you might expect to see more setups like this in different parks around Melbourne. The goats will gradually be introduced to seven fenced off plots in Royal Park over the next few weeks. And as tempting as it may be, visitors are asked not to touch or feed the goats while they're hard at work, making life better for their reptilian friends. Hopefully come spring, uh, we'll see more lizards than ever uh, scurrying around in this area. And give these cute eating machines a well-earned rest. Isabella Tolhurst, ABC News, Melbourne.